Um, welcome back again. This is uh, acting number two vlog. <laughs> um, so what we're going to do this week is kind of just go over what improvements I've gone through um, from last week's video to today um, and then kind of talk about a couple of things that I've said in my previous acting video um, and just talk about what I'm going to do to make that better as it's a major thing for me in um, my musical theatre and my myself personally um, but what we're going to do today is so I'm just going to go through a couple of uh, exercises but I'm going to do a couple of vocal exercises um, as the physical warm up I can't really do it at the moment um, I've my back is in I've, I've my back is in a lot of pain as I've a few weeks ago I previously broke my corsix so there's kind of some days where it's good and some days it's bad and obviously today it's decided to play up on me which is great um so obviously you can I've been doing I think I've been doing both that physical warm-up um throughout the week uh it's very helpful it obviously helps like your diaphragm which is great um I've also been doing making sure I stay in shape making sure my vocal cords are all right um but let's get started so our first exercise obviously they are both vocal warm-ups and then we are going to get to talking to a second mystery thing that i've spoken about in my last video um or my last acting video anyway uh so what we're going to do again is we're just going to do peggy babcock three times um or well, once three times and then we are going to do uh six stick thistle sticks also, we will be doing Peter Piper picks a peck of pickled peppers. And then one that I actually didn't mention in my last video, um, but it is called I Saw Susie Sitting in a Shoe Shine Shop, where she sits, she shines, and where she shines, she sits. And obviously, we did learn this one from college, um, but it is actually it's one of my favourites to say because it's a long one and it's very like, it's very tongue twistery. I couldn't think of another word. Um, but it's one I've been I one I use the most probably out of the four that I've mentioned now. Um, but let's get started. We will start with Peggy Babcock. We'll do each one. We'll do each tongue twister once three times. So Peggy Bab Be Peggy Babcock Peggy Babcock Peggy Babcock. And then we'll just keep doing that until we reach the end. And then I will tell you the mystery thing that I said in my last video. Obviously, so now what we're going to do is we're just going to go through each four of the tongue twisters uh, once three times. So we'll start with Peggy Babcock. Um, also, if you want to, I tend to do this with my hands sometimes. Um, it helped me a lot when I first started doing tongue twisters. Even now it works well. Um, but if you just use your fingers to just go against, so like Peggy Babcock, Peggy Babcock, Peggy Babcock. Just so you know in your head what what the what the vowels and what the sounds are um but let's get started so we'll do the first one we'll do peggy babcock three times and then the shoe shine one we will only do once just because it's a longer one um and then we will go on to our mystery thing that i've said in the last video um, but let's get started so peggy babcock peggy babcock peggy babcock and i'll do it again just once with the fingers just so you can see the difference and then i'll carry on the rest with the fingers as well Peggy Babcock, Peggy Babcock, Peggy Babcock. There we go. And now six thick thistle sticks. Six, six thick thistle sticks. Six thick thistle sticks. Six thick thistle sticks. And our Peter Piper. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. And our, our, shoe, our shoe shine one now. I saw Su I saw Susie sitting in a shoe shine shop. Where she sits, she shines, and where she shines, she sits. There we go. All sorted. So that is all of our tongue twisters now. Um, I'm so sorry that I can't do the physical warm up as well. I wish I could. I it really does help me a lot trying to get my body back in shape. Um, keep everything healthy. Keep my diaphragm healthy. Keep my like my vocal range healthy and everything just it just makes it feel better um obviously due to my um issues with my back i'm really sorry that i can't do it today um but now let's jump on to our mystery thing 
which is actually confidence. I've said it in my I said it in my last video, um, but basically, it's it's a funny thing for me really because people think I'm people think when I say oh I I'm stage scared or and things like that, I've got stage fright or whatever. It's it's weird because for me um, when the lights are up and when like the show's on and everything it's like nobody's there nobody there's nobody backstage there's nobody in the audience it's just me singing on the stage and it i just feel really confident and i just it's different because i can't and i think it's just because i can't see anybody because when the lights are up and i can see people and they're just staring at me and they're not and i feel like they're not blinking and it it makes me really nervous and and for me personally i've dealt a lot with some not so great things in the past um and even now and it i think it's hurt my confidence down and it stuck it down quite at all to the point that i can't stand in front of a group of 17 people and sing a song because those people have caused issues for me in the past but um it's it's hard because i want to be able to stand up in front of an audience without any lights and without anything and just sing and not care what they think but it's so hard sometimes and i got a comment on my last video by uh, my shooter michael um who gave me this who sent me a link to this video and it honestly is so amazing and it's so interesting to watch and it just it's so helpful and i've been trying to I've been trying my hardest to go against that and it's it's such a big help and from looking at that video it's I went through YouTube for a couple of hours at least and oof, last week I did and I looked for videos of people singing for the first time on YouTube or singing for the first time for a bunch of people and videos to of things that could help bring my confidence up with singing in front of people and um, and I found some amazing ones and I'm just I just want to be able to uh, one day very soon hopefully to be able to stand up in front of even if it's just my my course group to just stand in front of them and, and sing a song and not care um and so for my my kind of in my my own opinion my first step is what I want to do is I am going to, I've said it in my singing video, but I'm going to do a rendition of Rolling in the Deep by Adele. Um, I'm only going to do part of it, as well as part of the next song, which is I Can Hear the Bells by Hairspray, uh, sang by Tracy, who is my favourite character. Um, but for me, that's kind of a first big step um, towards singing in, in person, which is silly, um, because I think putting a video up for everyone to see or how many people you want them to see it is really big and and it, it's a bit it's a little bit nerve-wracking I will admit but I know it's I know it's the right thing to do and I know it's the right thing to go about um doing it but I I hope it goes well um again I am sorry that I couldn't do the physical warm-up um it's my fault I fell weeks ago it's still healing. I've had my ups and downs with it, but it's 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 all right. Um, but hopefully in the next week or so, um, I will be back up and running, and I will be fine to do dancing again, which will make me very excited. Um, but hopefully the also the two renditions of the songs or the covers, whatever you want to call them, um, will be up between either hopefully Saturday or Sunday. And if they're not, because I have a very busy weekend this weekend. Um, I will put them up on Monday, um, because I'm very, I'm kind of nervous, but I know it's the right thing to do. Yeah, like, it is the right thing to do, because I know, I know it will benefit me in the end, um, but that is everything I'm, I know it was very, I know it was a very deep last few minutes, um, and I'm sorry that it was a bit longer this time, uh, but I wanted to make sure I got everything in and showed you the improvements that I've done over the past week. Um, and things that I will carry on doing until we do go back um, but I, I hope everyone is okay especially with what's happening at the moment um, and I will try and keep you up to date and I will make sure I post those renditions um, if, if not Saturday, Sunday, Monday I will promise
fingers crossed. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye.